Okay, now let's take a look at the different questions for scene photos. Where is it? What is in the foreground? What is in the background? What is happening? These are the questions you need to think about when you look at a scene photo. Let's start with the first. Let's take a look at the first question. Where is it? Is it in the countryside? Is it in a city? Is it inside a building? Outside a building? Try and think about the location of the scene. Let's take a look at an example. People are relaxing on a white sandy beach. The waves crash against the rocky cliffs. The man is climbing the wall. The beach is crowded with people. In this picture, we see the ocean and cliffs. The waves below are crashing into the rocks. The correct answer is B. Next, let's take a look at the second and the third question. The second question was, what is in the foreground of the picture. The foreground means the front area of the picture. The third question was what is in the background of the picture? The background is, well, the part that is in the back of the picture, the back area. Knowing the foreground and the background can often help you answer these photo questions. Let's take a look at an example. A. The peaks of the mountains are covered with snow. B. A man is fishing in the river. C. There are many birds flying above the woods. D. Snow covers the river bank. In the foreground, we see a river. In the background, we see mountains. The mountain peaks are white with snow. The correct answer is A. Fourth question. What is happening? Are there birds flying across the lake? Are people spending time in a park? If there's something happening in the picture, you need to know it. Let's take a look at an example. A. The cars are moving along the highway. B. There are many people crossing the street. C. The parking lot is full of cars. D. There is a large traffic accident on the road. We see some people driving their cars on the highway. The correct answer is A. Okay, now let's review the scene photo questions. Number one, where is it? Number two, what is in the foreground? Number three, what is in the background? And number four, what is happening? Try and remember these questions and ask yourself these questions whenever you look at a scene photo.